Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maggie. If this is your first time stopping by, I hope you decide to like and subscribe and click the notification bell and then come back and check out some of the other content I have on my channel. I am at Dollar Tree and I'm thankful because I haven't been able to do a shop with me in a while. And this is actually one of my Dollar Trees I haven't been to, I want to say, since December, so it's been a minute. So let's go in and see what kind of new spring things they have. The stores are very well kept. Those are good. Pretty cake. I haven't seen these. I think those are new. These metallic, I remember these because I've had these before. These are cute too. The little sea animals. And the dinosaur. Although, correct me if I'm wrong, I want to say there was six they used to offer instead of four. So, there's that. These are back. Little animals. I have those from last year. And these are rubber carrots or chicks. Okay, clear chicks that you fill with treats. Let's get some. And there's the carrots. Okay. More animals. And then the cupcakes in the back. These guys are fun. And then the sports. Okay. I these for a lesson. These are like the camouflage looking ones. These are cute. I'm wondering if, oh, and I love these. These bunnies and the cute little chicks. I didn't get any of the chicks last year, but I do have the bunnies. So yeah. And here are the clear bunnies. And speaking of bunnies, <laughs> there's the gnomes with the bunny ears. Here's some different grasses. I usually get one bag of grass per bag, per thing, you know. But here's the cute little bunnies. Grab these while you can. It used to be these were super hard to find, but they seem to be making them in greater quantities now, which is awesome. I like to make little outfits for them and embellish them. This bunny felt garland is stellar. There's eight. Really nice. And then the window clings and the beads for your tear trays. And then the signage. Look at that. Very cute. Welcome spring. Here's the doormats. These are okay. They're, they're cheap. These are new this year. The uh, fabric carrots, which are nice. Glad they're doing it. They have different textures in there. It's really cute. Okay, and then they have the pillowcases. Excuse me, like that. Also available in blue. These farmhouse are very pretty and then of course all the spring floral you can really make your home look beautiful okay let's continue down here here 
there's the headbands and more of the eggs. There's the goofy face eggs. Drink cups, treat bags. They have all different kinds and these are really cute. Chilling with my peeps. These are adorable. Um, the towels, although maybe not the best quality, is a great way to just decorate your um, kitchen. It's cheap. And it's a great way to transition from one season to the next. Start getting all the Here's table covers. I like the plaid for me. Once again, not necessarily wanting the stuff that um, screams Easter, Easter, but just a nice pale color that I could use not just for Easter. <laughs> and here are your buckets. These large eggs, which are nice, you could personalize it with. Um, if you have a cricket, um, fill it, and give it to them. They have the smaller version of those that I think you get. Is it two? Yeah, looks like you get two here, or maybe just one. The four-piece fabric gift bags. They're cute for like the treats. These are two piece. They're a little bit more deluxe. They have new patterns in the ears. They've had the polka dots this year. It looks like it's just the chevrons and then this cute little. And then the. Um, these are nice to make little Easter treats for your guests. And then these buckets here to make a huge Easter basket. Hoppy egg hunt, everybody. And then the egg decorating kits along with the paddle balls and then the big bunnies up here that you can fill. These right here would be cute to decorate your Easter table and put some things in it. You know. And then look at the plethora of Easter bunny ears. Literally. And the baskets down here. There's the soccer football and basketball and then the bunnies and chicks and all that there's even sharks and alligators over there really cute guys really cute these coloring cups nice and then we get into some of the gardening stuff that they have here don't overlook the stuff here because you could really they've hit the mark on quite a few things these little stackable um, three pots, you could put quite a few things in there, so don't overlook the gardening section. Dollar Tree can help you get started on a great garden. All right, we're going to come down this Easter basket filler aisle. I know they got to have some really cute stuff. All right, here's the spirograph type thing. These are the squishy toys that have like the, you know, what do they call those? These are the uh, posable, posable Barbies, although these aren't really super good quality. They're better with the knees. Okay. We have our little egg inside the dinosaur, which is cute, and it looks like there's Smarties inside. Where does he go? Okay, we'll wait. Puzzles. The little activity sets, Air. the glitter ducks, okay. these are the, and the, I love those, ponies. Turbo wheels. I bet these are the ones you pull back and then they go forward. Here are dentist and doctor kits. These is another one of those 
queasy. Baby dolls. Very cute. They've, they've really improved the quality of these. And here's the totally tiny. Oh, we're getting into some stuff. Here's the totally tiny. And I told you how you can you can feel it and just determine. This is a hot dog and corn on the cob. Probably gummy bears and a pretzel. I'll grab three more glow balls. Sticker sets they also have in here. Um, Sets, and that's also where they have the, um, oh, here, who's this? Daisy Duck. An Encanto Mold. Here's a Squeezy Dinosaur. And these are the little Tsum Tsum kind of plushies, bubble sets. I'm going to try this novelty light projector. These are the washcloths that are wrapped up to look like lollipops. Which I think is darling. That's good for like a teen's basket. Here we go. And then you have the gelato lip balms. And then the soap crayons. Okay, I don't like anything like this. Sorry. Bouncy ball, scented bath bomb. That's a bluey scented bath bomb. And this must be, we have some more over here that glow. Nice. summer things with um, jump ropes, the bubble blowers, the chalk, and some more of these pops. Oh, that's a shame that someone just ripped up this, this whole section. I'll leave it up to them to fix. That's a shame when people tear up a display. There's more matchbox cars and summer things. Hula hoops. Here's some uh, yarn craft kits and gingham bunnies with the bows. Pom pom kits. Good stuff. Now this is what I was talking about for the things I'm going to be making for my granddaughters. Two of these bowls and then two of these bowls that you'll tape together and create a bunny body. I'll be doing a DIY off camera and then doing the second one on camera if it works out and I'm satisfied by it. The store always does a really good job of keeping everything in order, so I like seeing that. The Hot Wheels Matchbox car wall is looking good. Good to know I can come here and pick up things for Easter eggs. I am on the hunt for the Lego flower kits. The these for flowers. The make it blocks. I heard they have flower kits now. And so I'm curious for those. I'll probably wind up getting a few of those for um to go inside the eggs for the egg hunt. But I saw someone haul those and I'm like, ooh, I'm very interested in that. Because <laughs> I think that would be fun. And I'm not seeing them. I'm seeing just the cars and these are fun. Okay. They 
still have some doll furniture, which is always nice. And the doll bathtub, which is the right size for this, but they have the doll that's all vinyl is a perfect fit for that. And then these cute little plushies, which would be cute in an Easter basket. <clears throat> Some more squishies down here. Okay. Air clay, action figures. Now you tell me. You could literally, for a little girl, get one of these. Pick up this and the kayak, okay, pick up a set of that, a set of that, and then they have one for jewelry, pick up some Barbie clothes, these are outfits, there's dresses, there's pants, and get an actual Barbie Barbie from Walmart, not one of the dolls from here because I don't think they're worth the quality, but you could put the doll in here, put in the shoe and accessory sets along with the clothes and the little kayaks. You tell me a little girl wouldn't love that. I know she would. Let's see, here's some more. A swimsuit and these do fit Barbie. Okay. What a great idea. And then these dolls here, the Forever Friends, their case is right here. And their outfits are here. They have a whole line of dresses. There's like six different dresses here. But then they also have these sets, which come with outfits and accessories, and up there as well. You could throw something like that together for a little girl for a birthday. I don't know, as a little girl, I would have loved that. Oops, everything's broken. But there's so many things that you can get. Now find a quality doll. These are good quality dolls, so you could trust this here, but get a regular Barbie and one of those, some of the Barbie brand accessory packs and the, and the um, fashion clothes. Great, great gift. Cute little play food. I've actually gotten these for my granddaughter. They're in her little play kitchen. So are these. I got every last one of these. And these are 18 inch doll size. You got a daughter or granddaughter or niece or whatever who has an American Girl doll. That's their size. Many, many tea parties with her big dolls, as she calls them, and here's the uh, Barbie furniture. Now you get a whole set of furniture to add to that Barbie outfit, and you grab these backgrounds. There's four different backgrounds, if you can find all four. Yep, there's no reason why. Oh, these are cute. Okay, these would be cute for Easter. I'm gonna have to get some of those. And these are the regular art kits. So much stuff that you could do here. Just really, and it's not, you look for the quality stuff. Oh, look, I didn't see these. I've seen the dolls, the, the Barbie doll or the paper doll ones, but I haven't seen the um, dinosaur ones. That's nice, that's a nice activity. And they have a Transformer one too. And then look at this. Nice. Okay, what's this? This is a sticker activity pad. Okay, look at that. 12 activity pages, 100 stickers, and one play scene. That's nice. That's a cute basket stuffer. Okay. Do you see this books section? This is the neatest books section I think I've ever seen. And then look at this. These giant activity pads down here. This makes my heart happy. Some of these I've never heard of, but I would be tempted to try. And I've been finding Hallmark books. Equestria Girls, do you have someone who loves those? 
I've been finding, oh, yours cheerfully, 18 years. Um, they've had Hallmark books in here. So basically, like one of my favorites was Journey Back to Christmas with Candace Cameron Bure. That story where she's from the 1940s, World War II, and a comet causes her to get thrown into um, the future in the same town. And she sees how much her life means. Here's a Hallmark book. I have this one. This is a gingerbread romance. This is based on one of their Christmas movies. Based on the Hallmark Channel original movie. I think this one starred one of the twins. Uh, Taj, but not, you know, the Maori twins. I think it starred her. And let's see, what's this one here? Is this Hallmark? Christmas at the Cupcake Cafe. I have this one too because I love Christmas stories. Okay, what's this one? Okay. Okay, that sounds like it might be cute. Okay. This is another Hallmark movie. Christmas at the Amish Market. I'll get this. Because I love the Hallmark. <clears throat> okay. A little bit of a mess here, but... Always great to add books. I'm always on the hunt for books for to read on my channel. Okay. Oh, there's a color book I've never seen. I saw that movie. It's pretty good, you know, if you like those kind of movies. We saw it when, last year when we went to uh, Mississippi. Okay. And most of these I've seen, like the Snoopy books. I've read all those on my channel. The Arthur books, the Daniel books. Pretty sure I have all the Hardy Boys. Look at this. This is cute. But if you're like me, you prefer characters you're familiar with instead of someone's interpretation of those characters. So, oh, they have Yu-Gi-Oh! Here's some more springtime anime. Okay. Yeah, I love the way they really keep it. The store's a mess. They're either understaffed or they got really inconsiderate customers who will just tear it up, which I've never been like that. So, yeah, I love the book section. Very nice. Here's some more um, Easter basket stuffers on the end caps. Like I said, I'm going to keep my eyes open for those Make It Blocks um, flower kits. There's four of them. Okay, so they have the cute little silly strings. <clears throat> we got these <clears throat> one year to be a, a fishing game for the big dolls <laughs> <clears throat> lots of really cute play opportunities the cloth dolls here the soft vinyl dolls and then more of the fashion dolls and puzzles and then the, the trucks and cars down there so spirographs spiral art very nice all right, I spotted these collapsible baskets, but they also have the ones with the handles. They, they come in blue, gray, and black. So when you're not using them, you can collapse them. I, they work very well. The ones with the handles, I got a couple of them for um, my house, for Eleanor, for her bathroom um, essentials. 
And shouldn't this go over here? And move all this stuff down. Right? Does that make more sense? But yeah, I love these. They said these are really great for organizing pantries and your drawers. I love these for the refrigerator, you know, to put things in. Caddies and stuff. It's just, I love it because it can keep things orderly and looking really nice and organized in your home, which I like that. It makes me, um, there's a peace and calm that comes over me when I know things are in their place. Anyone? Just me? Okay. I think this is a Great Sense Febreze um, dupe. Okay, smoke and odor eliminator. All right. This is the air fresheners and, yeah, this looks like it's all the air fresheners, room f sprays and different things like that. Sure Sense, Wizard, all the good stuff. Right, we're getting into the school supplies and um, teacher section. It's a shame to see some things looking a mess. I do need to pick up a couple of these. Okay. I don't know why people just don't put things back the way they find them, you know. There's the prayer boxes. Writing tablets, ink pens, sharpies, dry erase, they have it all here. Gel pens. These are really good. Okay. I love office supplies. I will get in trouble in a heartbeat in the office supplies section. And behind me they have more of the scissors and rulers and pocket calculators and the grocery lists, magnets, all the things to make your life. You can grab things up from here. Like I said, it's looking a little sloppy, so I guess they just need to come through. That's too much for me to do right now. Okay. But I like they have the weekly planners, and then they have the organizers, the metal ones, and the, um, the shelving. And these... What is this? Oh, this is a tape dispenser. Look how nice that is. So you have the um, John corner office, which is more of the chic, executive, high-end look. That'll be the beige and brown. And then you have the regular jot. So a lot of these things are in the corner office section, so it still look like it belongs in an executive office. Tape, and then we're getting into stickers and the wood stuff. This is in the um, stencils. I'm looking to see if I see any new stickers that I don't have yet. I've already got so many stickers, it's not even funny. These are the chalkboard stickers, great for making labels if you're doing food um, meal kits and things like that in your prepper pantry. So this is a great way to label them so you know what to, to, that meal is and what, you know, just labeling anything, your baskets or anything. And it smells great in here because right behind me we have the candles and fragrances. It's actually getting a little overwhelming. I need to move on because it's a little... This is a new shaped candle, but it's the apple cinnamon. This is the um, luminescence. This is actually my favorite fragrance of the main line. So these are new boxes with the cutouts. That's very nice. Very nice. You could stain it or paint it. I don't know how these are supposed to go in there. Look at that. Isn't that darling? And then they have these wood carving set. I have no idea if those are any good. I know there's, they have an X-Acto knife set that is not the best quality that I would not recommend getting. But then they have the wood planks. Totally use these in building, making furniture. And I'm glad to see that they have those. Oh, wait, look. 
Oh, I love the wall art. They get in here sometimes, but it's kind of hit or miss. Sometimes you get a full set, and others just not so much. There's the plain canvas. They even have the black canvas. Puzzle saver. So you want to laminate your puzzle after you put it together. It's nice. Craft and bead storage. I actually use this to store Barbie's shoes in my granddaughter's um, Barbie case. And they have the pom-pom makers and then all the brushes. These I don't like, nor these. I prefer these. <clears throat> I don't like these either. These were more for spreading glue. And then you get into the vinyl. Oh, the paper packs. They have so many different kinds of paper in here. You just never know what you're going to get. Really worth a dollar and a quarter. Really worth it. Okay, and I'm looking for the fabrics. For the longest time, I could still have never seen the fur. Thank you so much, Tracy. For Here's the thing, I told you, not worth it. It's very cheap and it doesn't hold the blade well when you're trying to cut it and so it could come loose and cut you so I don't recommend that but I've never seen the fur Tracy sent me some and I so appreciate it the little fake fur this is uh, fabrics I got tons I got to go through and then if I need to come get more fabric for the bunnies I'm gonna be making then I'll come back and get some more they even have diamond painting sheets this is this would be a great stock and stuffer as with these little crochet sets. Very cute. I don't think they come with the crochet hook, so you'd have to get the crochet hook here too, which is around here somewhere. They've got them, I know it, so yeah. St. Patrick's Day, now this is cute. Look, I've never seen the suspenders, or have I? That's cute for the fellas. Fun tie, and then all the different little beads. Fun socks. I like these and those. I actually got this one and this one, and I turned them into hair bows for my granddaughters. This one I sewed onto a headband for Nora, and this one I sewed a barrette to it for Eleanor. And then there's the hats. I mean, if you're going to go all out, why not? Okay. Fun little skirts you can throw over the top of your pants. And then look at this. I love it. Little cauldrons that you could, uh, or pots of gold. Nice. I have to get my stuff out. Okay. They got the spring dishes out, which are cute. This isn't my favorite print. But I see where they're going with it. I'd like them to update that to something else and include yellows and oranges in there, not just the pinks and the greens, but it's still pretty. You can get this with the gray or the sage green to make a nice little spring place setting. Maybe grab this with that. What do you think? Yay? Nay? <laughs> you can overdo the prints for sure, but having a solid in there would break it up. I don't know about the silver. I wish they'd come up with something that's non-metallic for the Easter. A three-pack of chicken ramen with the cups for $1.25. I think that's a really good deal. Okay. Looking and looking. This is the snack aisle. What is this? Okay, these might be some fun things to get for Easter baskets and whatnot. I'm on the hunt for more sipping broth. Okay, I don't think I've seen these before. Made with Reese's peanut butter cups. Cornbread crisps, honey butter. These might be, they sound delicious. The freeze dried fruit is delicious. Delicious. You could throw these into your cereal in the morning or even just eat them as a snack. They're really good. They would last a long time, so grab those up and put them in your prepper pantry. Vegetable crisp. I love the harvest snaps. White cheddar. Okay, I'm looking for the sipping 
powder. All kinds of delicious things that you can get here. Okay, I'm seeing the Northies are good for your um, pantry. Okay, I'm going to get some of these. This is already cooked rice. Country gravy mix. Spanish rice mix. Taco sauce. The gnocchi, potato gnocchi. The Pioneer Country gravy. Two cups of gravy, I love it. It's this. Okay, this is refried pinto beans. That is a big package of pinto beans. And then you have long white rice and then roasted chicken flavor rice. And then of course your regular beans and rice down here. Do not get this, get that. And then there's more of the Spanish rice. As I said, here's the Velveeta cheese. Great for your prepper pantry. Be warned, it takes two of these for a pound of pasta. Okay, but this is good to have to add. And then the, the instant potatoes. And then let me get this. Creamy garlic. Okay. Breadcrumbs. I, again, am looking for the sipping broth. This, I think, is supposed to be like a hamburger helper thing. I don't know if you like that or not. Okay. <clears throat> Olives, pizza crusts. Come on, where's that sipping broth? They come down this way. Okay. These spices are always good. Make sure you, in your prepper pantry, they grab a couple of these. Because if you got beans and rice and no seasoning, yuck. So grab some. These right here are good as well. And then they have these down here, which I picked up. Fresh success. So that's a good way. There's the citrus garlic. I just picked these up. Garlic and herb. And then they had a tomato basil. Yep, here it is right here. I love this. The tahini, it's chili lime. Ooh, is that stuff good? Okay. Here's your boxed milk, which is good, and they have the almond milk as well. This stuff definitely lasts longer than you realize. I had one that was past expiration date, and I opened it and smelled it, and it was still good, and it was like almost six months past the expiration date. I tasted it, I drank some, and it was fine. You know, your nose tells you. So. <clears throat> I prefer the powder, though I feel safer with that, so I did not see any sipping broth. I'm going to go back and check. Okay. I have looked for these. There's two in here for so long. I'm going to get a couple of these. I've never found these in, they had them in like the fall prints, but those are reusable. I love them. And wow, they have them here. They're very pretty for the spring. Look at that. All right, coming down the health and beauty aisle, makeup and nail polish. We seem to have some new spring colors in. Pink. This is by Kiss. If you're getting the gel nail polish, make sure you get the acetone remover or it will not go off. And then there's some colors over there. I always have some good stuff. That's pretty. Candy Moyo. That's more my speed. This park holiday. These are okay, but they're too brown for me. I need something a little more pink. Okay. I got that for Eleanor. It actually smells like strawberry, which is really cool. Oh my gosh, look at this. 
Those are pretty. I mean, they're sharp and they have the, the Kiss sculpted ones. But Helios Nail Systems, that's a good brand. Okay. The color. All right. Here's more of the Helios. It looks like it's the same. Okay. Some more down here. This is iced. This is iced pigment powder. What is this for? Loose metallic powder. I see it. Oh, it's an eyeshadow. Okay. So they have here this is glisten. And then they have twinkle and gleam as well. So and that's the color. If you're into that. Okay. <clears throat> little caboodle kits. I remember when those were all in the rage in the 90s. I just love that there's so many things you can get for your, you know, yourself and someone else. This is uh, lip jelly. These are really nice. They feel really good. This one, I think this is the one I have. It's a satin lipstick and this is, they call it lip jelly. But they have nude, sandy, and rose. blue. That'd be a cute Easter gift to put together for a teen girl. These are nice, super nice. You know, I'm going to get one of these for me. I have this, this palette at home. Thanks. Beauty Intuition. Love your lips. Nourishing. Okay, this is a lip gloss. Mm, I love that. Okay. Very nice. Be Pure has a hydrating mascara with hyaluronic acid. Okay. All right. Found a few new things. Health and Beauty. These are really good. I really recommend you get these. The vitamin C drops. And then the Grin. That's a brand that Walmart carries and Target as well. It's much more expensive there than it is here. So they travel doors. Guru Nanda dual line thread floss picks and then these are the um, covers for your toothbrush to keep them clean calcium biotin super B complex they have some good stuff here women's daily with iron so check out what it is I've tried these as well these are really good This is the brand, The Nobleman. Pore refining face and body cleansing wipes with tea and charcoal, tea tree and charcoal. And this is refreshing face and body cleansing wipes with aloe and grapefruit. That is a name brand. I bought a Nobleman set for my husband for Christmas and it was like 15 bucks at Walmart with some of their, a couple of products and a travel bag. So, hi Jean. Okay, the fun hair accessories. They have some new cute barrettes. Look at these gummy bear barrettes. Look at these. So these are um, bobby pins with gummy bears on them. Look at the star hair clips. These would be cute for Easter to put in Easter, Easter eggs. Look at these. 
how pretty they are. Look at the butterflies. All very cute. Just different color of the same kind of barrettes. I'll be coming in here to pick up some stuff. And then there's head wraps. These are adorable. With the watermelon and a floral. These are the scrunchy. That's not a Dollar Tree brand. These are cute ponytail holders. This is a brand. This is Scunchy is the brand. And look at these. Scunchy brand. Scunchy brand. Look how pretty those are. How nice. And look at that one. And this one up here. So many to choose from with the starfish. And so adorable. No reason. Oh, look at that. Mm -hmm. No reason not to have neat, tidy hair. <laughs> and these pearl headbands. So nice. Look at those. Look at the Madison Tyler. Mm -hmm. Look at this. this one. Well, this one seems like it would get tangled up in my hair with all those chains, but still, it's cute. More Madison Tyler down there. Very nice. Okay. This is Cher Body Mist 60s Couture. This pink one is 70s Couture. This is a detoxifying facial scrub by Global Beauty. Bright and exfoliate and smooth. Hmm. I love that. Those are nice little body. They have a purple one that's supposed to be 80s couture. So, hydrating hand gel cream compared to Neutrogena Hydro Boost hand gel cream. And what's this? try it. And then you have the entire line from Global Beauty for the vitamin C and the collagen. These are great. You, I do recommend when you're getting the facial cleanser that you get two of these because you will go through this before this is finished. And this is a facial serum and this is an eye cream. And then they also have the cleansing cloths. You could put together a wonderful gift for someone. Okay. These are also fantastic by Be Pure. Body butter, vanilla bean honey, watermelon mint, and coconut lavender. Oh, day. This is compared to the Olay Regenerist once again. For the cream cleanser, look how much product you get. Get two of each of these for one of these. <clears throat> you will be done with that cream before you're done with the cleanser. Okay, and then... Wait, what is this? What's so miraculous about it? Miracle Skin Care Sponge, Bio Blenders, okay. Here's the Scented Bath Bombs. That one that was up front came from here. It's all kinds of great stuff. Really cute. Let me go down the baby aisle real quick. They do have these adorable little snack holders. A llama, a zebra, and that's a sloth. Oops. 
Those are very effective. They're getting pediatric, but they also have the Pediasure Grow and Gain. Those are nice. The fruit feeders, putting frozen fruit in there for the baby to teeth on. Those are really nice. This smells like crap. Don't bother getting it. It's terrible. And then, I've never heard of this brand. Gentle on eyes, gently cleanses and moisturizes. I'm not sure about this brand. It's made in Canada. But then you have the hats and also <clears throat> the baby headbands, which are adorable, and the bibs and the blankets, which you can use these to make all kinds of, use it like fabric to make clothes for dolls or things for babies. All right, they're getting in the fun socks, grits, pez, corn pops, Pringles, you got Space Jam, ketchup, Twinkies, Yoo-Hoo, Oscar Mayer hot dogs, Frosted Flakes, Old Bay, Kool-Aid, Sour Patch, Swedish Fist, Chips Ahoy, Fruit Loops, and Pop-Tarts. Those are adorable. So, there they are. I'm looking for the Gold Toe because I heard the Gold Toe had some more socks. There's some more um, Baby Shark if you're into that. I'm looking for the Gold Toe packs of socks and I'm not seeing them. But I'm liking these. Oh, I thought those were grips on the bottom. If they don't have grips on the bottom, I don't want them. Snuggadoos. Those are cute. Yeah, I'm not seeing any of the heel protectors. Ammo pay. That's good. All right. I'm not seeing any of the uh, <clears throat> gold toe. This could be at another one. And what's this? Oh, a faux fur muffler for around the neck. That's really nice. This one is softer than the black. Nice. These are heart-shaped straws. Look at that. I got a pack. Okay. I'm down the dish aisle. I'm not really seeing anything new, but you can come here and get a nice set of dishes for yourself. No excuses for cheat, too. Bubble tea straws. 50 of them. Wow. That'd be good for crafting if you don't drink bubble tea. to end this right here and get ready to take my purchases up to the register. I'm walking this direction so I'm away from people because I don't want anyone to be weirded out that I'm filming. I hope you decide to like and subscribe and click the notification bell. Come back and check out some of the other content on my channel and comment below if you're finding these things in your Dollar Trees. Bye until next time.